Good morning on day 129. Cheers. Coffee is something I look forward to every morning. And I usually drink this Trader, Trader Joe's single packet blend that has coffee and creamer in the packet. So anyways, um, I'm halfway packed up. Goose says he's getting packed up in his tent and it feels like rain in the air. And it does call for like a 40% chance of thunderstorm. So fingers crossed we don't run into that but actually we've been pretty lucky since we've been back on this time around we really had no rain so we'll see how it goes been an overcast day we can finally have a bit of a view if you can see all the ridges to the mountains over there and then we have some water right there looks kind of dark oh my gosh you guys the mosquitoes are absolutely terrible today. Like the worst day we've had. Arms, legs, face, neck, chest. And it's hard to kill them when you're hiking down a hill with your two hiking poles in your hands. But it's getting so frustrating. And then, after you kill them, here's a question for you. You know, blood comes out and they're like on your leg. Whose blood is that? Is that my blood? Is that the mosquito's blood or is that the blood from the person they bit prior? Gross stuff, huh? We don't have any bug spray. That's high on the list. And I think I'm gonna put my bug net on again too. Well, thanks to the New Jersey's High Point State Park, right off the trail, we're able to get bug spray. And a soda and a snack. We're happy campers. At least I am. Jesus. And we're sitting on a bench, guys. This is luxury. This is luxury. All right, just left that state park area. Cool looking sign. AT North. There's another AT sign. To the left. Okay, I found out this is New Jersey's highest point. So that Ablesk is, Ablesk, is that saying it right? Sure. It is called High Point and it's at, I think it was 1798 feet of elevation. I called, I called for a snack break. With my electrolytes. Looking at a field though, check this out. Isn't that pretty? All right, snack break's over, back to the trail and another field with mountains in the background there. Anybody know what this thing is called? Very cool, looks like it's on a bush. I don't know, but they're pretty neat. So we walked into town. This is Unionville, New York. So we got a pizza shop here, Annabelle's Pizza, and then right next over, ice cream. And then there's a general store down there, post office, which I wish I would have had some, a box sent there. Didn't, didn't communicate on time, but oh well. Gosh, we're getting lucky another meal made by somebody else. Life is good, huh? Alley cat. Here we are on 6 Main Street in Unionville, New York. Another meal out. We're gonna get spoiled. All right, we're gonna hike out of Unionville, New York. There's their general store. Very small town. Cute. We had pizza and ice cream, both very good. And very, pizza especially was very reasonably priced. All right, we're getting back on the trail. There's those white blazes. I'm not ready, I wanna hang out in the city more. Pretty. Happy, full stomachs. Beautiful field.
We've got about four and a half miles to go. It's about 5.30. But we don't need to eat when we get there. We just need to set up our tents. And it'll still be light, so we can do that. And we've had no rain today. Thank you, Mother Nature. So pretty. More pretty views from the field. Look at all the hay rolled up. So cool. There's the trail. The Appalachian Trail. This is kind of cool. You can kind of see the path this hay bear, this hay stack made. Rolled down a little bit of a hill right onto the trail. So cool. But we've made a new trail right around it. Check it out, guys. Gorgeous. Some water, some mountains, and I'm on a ni nice wide path. Of course, I'll be going back into the woods soon, but for now, I'm really enjoying this for the evening festivities. It's going to be a 20 mile day when I'm done. Well, you know how I'm always looking for benches on the AT. There's a bench on the AT. Goose decided to sit and I agree with him. I think we should sit. We only have a mile and a half to go. It's a very peaceful place. Goose is already setting up his tent. Mine will be right here in a minute. Go check out the privy. Right. I told somebody that I would give a privy tour. This one, someone else said it was a good one. So let's see if, if I agree. I like the nice wide ramp. Mm, it has a skylight. That's always good. Oh shoot, I was gonna use the uh, rock to prop it open. You have the cedar chips that's to put inside after you take a number two for the moldering privy part. Yeah, I'd say last night's one was better. The inside was painted pink. So I like that one better, but this'll do. Check out the view from my tent. Pretty nice. I heard some thunder rattling up above, but my tent's all set up and I'm ready for whatever happens.